Alright, so we're going to get to Sinai. That's the plan right now. I'm going to go to speed 2. We switched off and now I'm trying to host. <laughs> so, given... Hmm, the current situation, these guys, I don't believe, are actually vassals of Jerusalem. No, they're not. So, hopefully, before... Gonna get down there for... Or, actually, we'll go here. Uh, before this war ends... Or before my war ends, I'm sorry. I'll be able to get that 60 piety to hire them out, bring them over here, and just smash. I'm going to wait for him to help me siege this down. Which will turn the war around. No, stay here, help me siege. Don't leave. You fool. You're only preventing yourself from getting territory. Okay, good. Is there any way to work out what your expenses are? Ah, uh, never mind, my legion's troops. Did you rest? figure it out? Or? Yeah, my legion's troops rest. For uh, the reference, if you click on your main title, you can see an expense report. Three hundred. Is that enough for me to hire these guys for a while again? So 150, 150 divided by 15 is 10 months. Well, actually, it's not even 10 months because I get that six. Uh, I can hire these guys for quite a while, actually. Hey, Bulgarian band, I just hit the hire button. There we go. Uh, my cynical comments have made people look at things a different way. I've created more cynics. Cynicism is spreading. It is my religion. Oh, man. So if I've got this taking here, and they attack here, hopefully my liege will be smart enough to bring guys in to help me. And if he's not, well, fuck me. Plus the mercenary group is still like recharging, so I'll be getting more guys along the way. Alright, let's find someone for you. Obviously, you probably won't want to arrange your betrothal. Trilineal, I thought not. Um, let's see now. Savoy, maybe? Probably not. Who is this? You. can't talk to. Why can't I talk to you? Oh, you're too far away. I am isolated over here. This is a problem.
Okay, he's going to come here, hopefully, and just sit on it with me. Because I count towards his war score. Oh, don't end this. Not now. Let's just sit here. Fudge, he's going to have way more guys than me if I don't do this right. Um, Limited Crown Authority will approve of that. I gotta kill his 800, and then I gotta kill his 1200. What? He was two spaces away! How'd he get here so fast? Ah, oh, well, it happens. You win some. You win some, and then you get incredibly fucked. Or you just get fucked, and you win none. Sicily hired them out. Fine. I'll be broke for a little bit, too. That's what happens when you get ambitious. I should lower you guys. There we go. Widespread rumors say Pope Lucretius III leads the most wicked lifestyle. Quite unsuitable for any priest. Uh, we're going to have to pray for his eternal soul. What is that? Wicked priest? The Pope just got the wicked priest trait. Looks like we got a Borgia on our hands. Or should I say yours? I should have waited for my levies to recharge. I am the biggest idiot on the face of the planet. Why do I do these things to myself? Ugh. <laughs> Huzzah! Hooray for events that don't really take money away from me. Every so often, I find I forget to do that thinking thing. This is one of those moments. If I surrender, he imprisons me, right? Oh, I just lose the plot. Okay. That sucks. You're in a crusade. And you decided to revoke one of your... Uh... I wasn't actually fighting that crusade. But I, my mistake was I forgot to let my re levies re-pop up. Well, there wouldn't be Crusader Kings without a little bit of uh, cocking it up every now and then. <laughs> With a little bit of complete stupidity. <laughs> I'm going to be so broke for so long. I already borrowed money from the Jews. Um, well, that was not worth it. What can I do to turn this around? I have claim on the kingdom of Jerusalem. That's interesting. We will consider pushing that after I fail miserably, after I let my vassals recover. Is Orticid winning? Is what winning where? 
He's attacking Rum. Uh, the little dodgy guy. Or to kill. He appears to be winning, yes. Now's your time, Rusty! Must strike, etc, etc. Wait, Rusty's attacking Rum? Uh, I am such an idiot. So, uh, Rusty, I hear somebody's attacking Rum. No, 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 I'm not. No. You sure about that? You can if yeah. you want. Well, my, my border is about to be taken away from me, so... Triple E up here, right? Let's Galilee Triple E. It's weaker than I am. He might be the one to go for. You know what? If we have any chance of winning, which we have none, let's make that very clear. It's fighting him on the mountains. Just to again be clear, we have very little chance of winning. I'm going to ask him for gold. He refuses to pay, lose a prestige. Oh no! No. Fourteen percent. I am so pitiful right now. <laughs> I didn't realize it started with claim on the Kingdom of Jerusalem. But it helps. I'd feel better if I could get a few more guys. Is this mountains? Is this plains? Let's let him siege himself down a little bit. I can't really get reinforcements at the moment. If I could get that extra 3,000, not 3,000, 300. I'd be golden. Are you kidding me? No. Think so. Duke of Galilee. Duke of Galilee is the youngest. Betrothal. Yes. No. No, no. Successful crusade. Expand these boats. That helped a lot.
the moment he moves, I have to move back here. To his capital. Got a 22 Chancellor, so the next thing I'm going to do is just get claims and duchies around me. Make myself as powerful as physically possible. This is actually looking better. Now. Especially if I could just get him off of my stuff. All this violence seems to solve your problems, and life seems easier when you can just smash something. I'm an angry son of a bitch. Um. You will have my, uh, Inga educated. Doubt besets me. Oh, man. Sunny moral, moral authority is awful right now. We control one of our holy sites. Ooh. Catholic authority is amazing. <laughs> we have a minus 10 because the Pope has a bad reputation, though. My flag for the Holy Roman Empire is messed up. Is it? Yeah, it is. It looks like the yellow background, black eagle. For me, it's messed up. It looks like it looks like a Celtic symbol. I might need to um, revalidate my game at some point in time. Maybe delete my flag's cache, if there is one. Uh, do you mind if I go to speed 3, or...? Are we good for right now? Other than possible desync issues. Other than possible desync issues, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna give it a try. Nope, Rome got his shit together. Tell me if you need to slow down. That was unfortunate. Do I... Okay, so he's probably going to start marching down this way. Get out of my way. Perfect. Yes, do it. How good is the Cataphrac retinue unit? It's excellent. Clara? Well, that's excellent, because I can hire none of them. Uh, ah, shoot, I need to, I need to slow it down. down. What oh, that was my best bet. What do you generally go for when creating retinue bands? Uh, generally, I like to do the cultural one. Um, horse archers are fantastic, so your cataphracts are excellent. 
Um, but if those weren't available, if those weren't available, available? um, I guess it kind of depend on what the composition of my armies currently are. Not that I can't win. Let's um. You mean just kind of like make up for what you don't have? Yeah. Except for light infantry, I would just avoid that at all, all cost. Archers, yes or no? Archers are good. Like you need stuff. To, there's two phases in combat. There's a skirmish phase and there's a melee phase. And archers are excellent for the skirmish phase. It's as good as it gets. Um, Ulrich wants to join the Templars. Go right ahead. No, not new unit. Everybody merge. Alright, let's try it. This is planes. We have more guys. Wow, we are terrible. Oh wait, never mind. I could always use someone to train with and I could always use more friends. Um, okay. This is the problem here. We might not have enough guys to siege things down. None of the mountains, none of the mountains. Merge. So if we can um, deoccupy this, which we can. We can probably lower and raise levies again. Now oh, it's going to be a problem having enough guys to smash his shit on the mountains. And I sadly owe the Jews money. So I can't acquire more via that. The mad. He sounds terrifying. Ranger patrol, though. Probably not. Nope. My wife is pregnant, and this time doubt doesn't beset me. Uh, she's seven. Look at our matrilineal yeah, 21%. prospects. <laughs> he might get something if I kill all of his brothers. Mr. Venice. Jerusalem. Prince of Poland. Duke of Creation. I want to see his character. I want to see his character. Dalmatia. Okay, it's him. Honestly, he might be our best bet. We'll arrange a patrol with him, and if we think we see something matrilineally, and if we think we see something later, we will deal with it then. I'm uh, good for speed 3 again, if other people are. 
I'm good for that speed. I've not stressed anymore. Thank you. Thank you, Arnold. You're a good man. So, what's the word from the Eastern Roman Empire? A minor rebellion, which is a good measure of the strength. Trudy. And luckily, well, not so luckily, good news and bad news. We lost war against Rum, but by we I mean the Imperial Treasury, which I was happy to pretend to fill in exchange for my three de jure provinces. I have been excommunicated. Well, we King have a Lang terrible pope. Kinslaying does tend to have that effect. War for what? Okay. That would have been awful. Actually, I should have sieged this. Let's see what we can do about sieging that. Uh, what was the garrison on that? So much. Garrison's so high. I just have to keep killing his armies and wait until... My personal combat skills increased. And I'm brave. We'll lower and raise the levies again, then we'll go here. Free this up. Do we have 900 guys? Uh, math is not my strong suit. We do not. We're so close, though. It'll be so bad if I lose this. <laughs> Let's kill his 32 guys and then lower raise again. Hopefully he'll spawn another 32 that I can kill just to keep the war score down. 
I hope you enjoyed our feature presentation, and if you did, you should take a couple seconds to check out some of my other videos. Up top, I have a link to my Eric the Heathen Let's Play. To the left, I have a tutorial video I made showing the intricacies of Gavelkind in Crusader Kings 2. And if you could, I would be much obliged if you, like and, if you liked and subscribed. Thank you very much, and have a wonderful day, and may all your dreams come true.